In this video, I will show you how to make an email address that is associated with your website. So this can be a way to have a more professional email address. So for instance, I'm on LakeOzarksBoatCharters.com. I'm going to make an email with this website. So it's going to be something like Dana at LakeOzarksBoatCharters.com. So to do this, we want to log into our cPanel. So we want to get into our control panel with HostGator. So you'll need to find your information to log back into your control panel. Um, here is our information here. So I need to grab the username, which is Dana, and the password right here. So I'm going to log in. And once you get logged into your control panel, we will want to scroll down and click on email accounts right here under mail. I'm going to click on email accounts. And here is where we're going to create our email address. So I am creating this for Dana. That will be his email address, Dana at LakeOzarksBoatCharters.com. And I will create a password for him. Okay, 500 should be good. And I'm going to hit Create Account. And okay, so now our email address is set up. And now there's a couple of different ways we can access our mail from this address. So if we click on more right here, we can see that there's an option to access webmail. So let's click there. And these are a couple free email clients that we can use. So for instance, Roundcube, we can click on read mail using Roundcube. So if we click that. We will see that we've come to an area where we can access our mail. So Dana at LakeGozarksBoaters.com and we have his mail area. So that's pretty cool. Now a lot of you may want to associate this email address with your Gmail account. So we can set it up so that the email account, uh, the email account that we've just created goes to our Gmail inbox. So let's set that up right now. Let's go back in here. Uh, let's actually X out of here. Let's go back to where we clicked on more and let's click on more and let's click configure email client. So we can even set this up in Microsoft Outlook as well. But I will show you how to set it up with Gmail. And here is our information to set this account up in Gmail. Now there's also instructions right here to set your email up using Microsoft Outlook. So if we go to our Gmail account and we will go to settings and let's click on settings again, we can add this new email account. So I'm going to go to accounts and I'm going to add another email address you own. For these purposes, I can use my name and let's add this new email address. Um, Dana at Lake Ozarks Boat Charters .com. And let's hit next up. Send through Gmail. 
that is what we want. Next up. And now they need to verify that we actually own this email address. So we're going to send ver verification. And then we need to go back to cPanel. We need to go back to RoundCube and check our email in the webmail client. So let's go to more again. And let's hit access webmail. And I'll check mail using RoundCube. And here is the email we've just received. So let's click on that. Double click it. And we want to grab this confirmation code for Gmail. So we'll copy that. Let's go back to Gmail. Oh, here is the box here. Let's paste the verification code. I'll hit verify. And it really is as simple as that. After doing this, we have now our email address in our Gmail account. So we can send email and receive email from our new professional email address. Now let's go to our inbox and let's test to make sure that we can receive and send email from our new account. So from, we can now see that we have a new email address here. So we'll do from, and I can just do to my Gmail, testing, and let's hit send. And we can see that the email is working properly. So you now have a new professional email address associated with your website.